Let's play Block Fortress. I'm Justin. I'm Anthony. And uh, we're back here with my base, uh, Anthony, that you accurately pointed out looks is looking more and more like a creepy prison. Well, it also, but it does look like a base now, right? The, it, it's it, it's come a long way from... Things have definitely escalated. A rapidly. really crappy first wall. <laughs> For sure. Uh, I learned a couple tricks on uh, tricks on Twitter. One thing that people pointed out is uh, not Twitter, uh, YouTube comments. People are actually leaving helpful YouTube comments, which is <laughs> people that actually yeah, that's that's unheard of. Which is an incredible rarity. Um, but what people pointed out to me was that since I paid to upgrade my machine gun towers to not draw ta not draw power anymore, that I should be placing some on treetops just around randomly. I see what you're saying. Like the mobs won't be able to get at them. Right, and, uh, right, You know, they don't need power, so I could have one like here. I could have one here. Right, so you'd have to build it without power, then upgrade it. Yeah, you know, you don't even need the power at all. So. Um, oh, is that for all your turrets? All, all my all my machine gun turrets. Oh, okay. I thought that was like on an individual machine no, gun turret. No, like basis. this is this is one of the you can you earn rare resources every time you play, and they carry over game to game, and you spend those. To I see. Well, yeah, in that case, you totally should. You should be throwing them out there. Um, I mean, I don't have any money to do it this round, but maybe next round. And the other trick that I learned, and this one might be an exploit, it might be something that ends up being patched. But the way that the enemy AI works is they. Uh, they like to attack blocks before they attack towers, and so you can have bait blocks. Like, embed them in the ground within range of all your towers, and then they'll wail on those blocks before they actually reach your base. I see what you're saying. So, like, five feet out, put one in the ground. Yeah, like, have have a bait block. You know, I actually can't. My pointer doesn't work. But uh, I don't have any money <coughs> to do it this turn. I mean, I guess I don't need to embed them. Like, if I were to do a block here and here and here, right? Like, I feel like that's kind of maybe cheating. Well, but what are you I do? don't know. For now, it's part of the design. I guess we'll find out if it's cheating when they decide to kill it. And I'm actually not even positive this is going to work. I just thought it was a reasonable suggestion to, you know, to try out. So, let's give this wave a shot, Anthony. They're coming from the south once do again. It. Okay. Mm, the mortar turret's already unleashing. Yeah. Oh man, I love those mortar. Oh, oh, we got jetpackers. That's not good. I don't know what their actual name is, but they... Yeah, where did that bastard oh, go? No. Well, so okay, he got killed in the base, but still, he's closing the gap really fast. So they jetpack over your walls and will, you know, climb... You know, the, it, that's that's their purpose, is to climb over your walls. Oh, see, look at this tower. Yeah, that bait block's totally working. It's working, but then when he was behind it, they also couldn't hit him. Bait yeah. block. Bait block. Is that like bait car? <laughs> I don't know. You ever watch that show? No. So bait car is like a reality TV show where the cops leave a car out and <laughs> like try to get it stolen. Wow, that's kind of messed up in a way. And then they have cameras in the car, and then it's like, oh, this. They're like, and then what's funny is the hidden cameras that are in the car. The people are always like, this better not be a bait car. <laughs> I mean, the thing is, is that like I don't mind catching criminals. Is one thing. I'm just saying, why do we have to turn that into a TV show? Yeah, I know. I don't know. This is not that I'm not guilty of watching a couple episodes of Cops. At no, some point for in my sure. Life. I mean, the point <coughs> is, these bait blocks are, like, these goblins are like, this better not be a bait block. I better not get shot if I <laughs> attack this block. Is he going to jetpack to safety? No, he's going to get wasted yeah. before he even gets there. He did get wasted. So, I totally think... Yeah, I think you dominated this wave. Those bait blocks are amazing. Yeah, I think that is a really... I don't, like, again, I don't know if that's cheating or whatever. Oh, what happened over here? Uh-oh. Well, so far, they've only broken through a little, although you're Dude. not doing so hot. You need to get out of here. Oh, I have some health. Oh, wow. Are my I'm a little disoriented. Okay, there we go. I can't tell. I can't tell. I feel like my mortar towers might blow up part of the earth with them. Like, I don't think the mobs do that. I actually don't know. Wow. Wow, well, they got all the way underneath. Yeah, that's a little bit of a problem. Ooh. But you can fix it on the next round. Man, you if I... I'm fix not, it in post. I'm not doing well, to be honest. Like, I'm not... I, I mean, this round is going well, but I personally have not been, like... I don't know if it's necessarily your fault. It's, things are getting pretty wrecked. Shoot. Yeah, I got to let him hit my you're base. getting pretty wrecked. Yeah, I got to go heal. I got to go heal. I'm at 50 health. S the clunky interface. Heal. Big Eat. berry bush. Eat. Big berry bush. Whew. All right. They are slowly breaking through right here, though. Yeah, they are. How, like, I can't figure out how that happened. Oh, yeah. Like, that's a gap now. Well, once he gets underneath, then nothing can hit him, right? Right. So then it's up to you. <laughs> Where's the last guy? Okay. Okay. I mean, that went okay. I mean, you took some damage, but nothing that's irreparable. No, I wish I had a better idea of like how and why that happened. Like I wasn't like one minute everything was there, and the next minute it was gone. No. So you know what's interesting? I placed this block armor on like my first level, 
right? So they, th the, the ground underneath my tower got destroyed. Uh, right? Because right. this was ground. This wasn't Right, blocks. that's why it had the shield blocks. The blo the yeah, that's what I'm saying. So I don't understand. <coughs> I wish I would have been paying more attention. Like, I don't know if my mortar tower did that. Or, or if, if they like, dig. Or if there's, a, yeah, if there's burrowers. Although, look how much of the ground out there is destroyed. Mm. Hold yeah. on, but look out farther. Your mortar turrets were hitting out farther, and I don't see any destruction. Yeah, that's true. I guess I don't know. I wish... I would have been paying more attention. I mean, that's definitely dirt that's gone. I'm sure of that. If anybody knows, you know, leave a comment and let me know. But it looks like someone's digging. Like, there's a block down there gone. Oh, wow. Yeah, that one's, like, down to stone. Okay. Well, let's build and do another round here. Do I have enough to upgrade? Oh, and someone hit my... Well, they my hit... My okay, yeah. They hit it once. But, yeah. I mean, someone got all the way in. I don't think that's happening. It's probably one of those jetpack guys. 100 money and 75 minerals. I mean, out of the 200 we have and 114, that's a lot. Yeah, but I mean, I would build up your base first, repair the holes, and then see what. And then you see have where left. we're at. Yeah. Sure, that's good advice. Uh, yeah, that's weird. These holes are weird. That was ground before. Now it's not strange. And yeah, yeah, yeah. they totally didn't get at. I remember uh, to recap, we built this. We built this mineral <laughs> resource last time, and we definitely overprotected it because I was terrified about it getting attacked. Um, so it's good to see that it survived. Yeah, but those machine guns will also serve a good purpose in general, too. For sure. Yeah, I'm not even sure where I need to repair. Like, I, I, This is really weird damage. I haven't seen this before. I do agree, though, that you should uh, consider just throwing out some machine gun turrets. Maybe? I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I actually haven't. What direction are they coming from? They're coming That's from the west. Yeah. So maybe we'll put one over there and see. just see how it works. They cost 20 money. Mm. Well, you got plenty of money. It's more the... And over here. They got all the way to this corner. Something did. Yeah, I don't know. Something was definitely blowing up stuff. I don't get it. Yeah. Maybe it is those jetpackers. I mean, that was the first time we've seen them. Maybe they have some ability to do something like that. All the way around this side. Weird. I think that's everything, right? Pretty much. Uh, although we could start filling in that hole in the wall that you have. Where? Here? I mean, that, yeah. Yeah, I really want to. I know you do. I'm just saying it's not a full fortress at the moment. So let me look at this. If I were to upgrade, it would give me access to the 50 caliber. Oh, well. Uh, the This is a slow turret and, yeah. a, and a flamer. Sure, let's just do it. But here's the thing. Like, this is expensive. This is 75 money, so I would only be able to build one. Yeah. Yeah, let's save it. Let's save it till one more round. Okay. And these were heroes, the mortars. Yeah, they sure. really are. So enemies are coming from the west. We can, okay, let me get my equipment set up here. We build, machine gun, plasma, mortar. Okay, so okay. where are you thinking we're gonna put some guns? Well, let's get the wall bolstered first. So like a machine gun there. And it's also gonna be night again soon. Hey. So the thing is, is that I feel like they were right. Like, machine guns out and some... Yeah, there you go. So why not? Maybe one here. Sure. They'll come from the side like that. Just get every little bit of damage counts, right? Okay. In case this doesn't work, for some reason, I don't want to blow more than that. Sure, I mean, maybe they'll get taken out super fast, but we can experiment with it. Especially since, yeah, you know, it really is smart since you don't have to use power for those now. Build up my block armor a little... Oh, it only goes on the sides. That's interesting. And one thing that I've learned, like, to manage your money better is, like, plasma towers, for example, only cost five money, but See, they cost 15 They're minerals. coming from the west, but what's going to happen when they swing wide and come through that gap? Yeah, you're right. Let's fill the gap. You're right. That's, this is a good time to do it since they're coming from that direction. Okay. Okay. I'm not super happy with. It's okay. It's okay. I'm gonna. I'm your initial fortress is fine. And then you can just use those trees as part of your defense. Yeah, I just I just got that one inside my base instead of outside. Build it too high. I'm not really sure if that does anything, but. So blocks. One thing that's strange about this game is blocks don't obey gravity, just like Minecraft. Except if you destroy a block, then the block above it does, like, fall. Like, it will sink. Weird. It's kind of interesting, right? Another machine gun. Machine gun. Okay. I think that's pretty good. Yeah. Unless they come. I mean, we've been holding so well at machine this point, gun. like, 
I figured just roll with it and see what happens. So here's the deal. Like, I'm almost completely out of money, but I have enough to build three more plasma turrets because they cost, you know, their so cost ratio money, is so different. minerals, yeah. I would say just roll with it. And just save that up for yeah. next round? Yeah, we do have to start saving at some point. You're right, you're right, you're right. And we did save if worse comes to worse. Okay. I gotta, I gotta think about buying another gun too. I have I'm level ten, so I have access to a machine gun. Oh, look at those guys! Are these like the heavies? Yeah, I think so. Those are the siege breakers. Yeah, they might be. Might. They're gonna get mortared soon enough. Oh nice. no! See that? I don't think they're taking damage. Oh well, maybe that's why you gotta get them to turn their backs. Yeah, I think you're right. I think I need to either be bait or like, you know, yeah, you need to strategically get them to turn their back. Or maybe they just have to get hit by a mortar shell because it does AOE damage. Yeah, I don't think those guys are taking any damage on their own. Like it, when when you when they're shooting their front. Whoa. <laughs> mortar. Uh, obviously it didn't damage any ground right there when it just hit. Oh, what's that? Why does he have the fist? Yeah, because he's the general. He buffs the units oh, okay. around him. That's why they have the green aura. Yeah. I don't even know what's going on right now. Yeah, there's, sorry. There's too many guys. I'm not, I feel like I've been a good, like, camera operator in the past, but these last couple rounds have No, been no, no. This stuff's getting more intense, man. What can we say? Yeah, he's got a shield. Oh, and that definitely took a chunk out of the ground. That, yeah, you're right. So, I, I don't know. I don't know how it works. Maybe it is the mortars just wailing on guys that reach your wall, right? Yeah, that could be. I forgot to place bait blocks. I'm glad we filled in this wall, Anthony. Yeah, that guy was attacking right where we pretty much put it in. Oh my god, there's like another general. I heard, I heard the mortars fire. Yeah. <laughs> what makes these goblins succeed where think they can succeed where others have failed? Well, yeah, I mean, this is a game that, just so everybody's clear, this game doesn't have an end. At some point, we <laughs> we will lose. That's what I don't like about endless runner games, by the way, actually. There's no way to win. Yeah. You, you eventually... Can only, you can be better than everyone, oh. but there's no way to win. Yeah, I agree with that. Oh, man. Anthony. Uh, they, Justin. They're, they're not stopping. 65 health, and you're getting wailed on. Slow down. Look at that. Yeah, the plasma pistol seems to do that a lot more. Probably because it has so much more of like a particle effect to its blast. Yeah. 43 health, Justin. Oh, how did he get inside? I don't know. Oh, God, the walls have been breached. Gotta heal, gotta heal, gotta heal. Eat. Eat. <laughs> Eat. Clumsy interface. Yeah. No, no, they're hitting the main, the mining block. They're hitting the mining block. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> I can't, it's, it's chaos now. This is by far the worst things have been. Oh, the goblins, oh. they overrun us. There's only three left. There's only three left. Yeah, actually, I feel like those internal turrets you have around your main building are really actually helping a lot. Yeah, but, I mean, here's the deal. Like, waves are only going to escalate from here, right? Sure. So. Eventually, you're going to lose, but you can, you know, we can learn Oof. from our mistakes. Our mistakes in this time where I don't know. <laughs> and did you notice how, so he destroyed this, block and, this then block, and then it fell. I think yeah. it's interesting that it does that, just, like, mechanically. Okay, okay, okay. And they're coming from the east. That's a good direction for us, usually. And well, you have a good high wall there. Actually, honestly, that they breached only in that one spot, it seems like. Weird. Like, Look at this. I don't understand. <laughs> I played why, this game. All, why all the tree branches went away, but yeah. the tree <laughs> trunk remains? Yes. There's a lot that I don't get. And, like, there's more stuff eaten away underneath. I think that is the yeah, mortar. Yeah, see, that's how they got under there. Yeah, I think it's the mortar tower doing that. I don't know how to prevent that. I don't know, build a mortar up on a tree with a power unit and just leave it way out in the middle of nowhere. Well, Anthony, this has been three commentaries now where I was just positive we were going to start it up and die. Yeah, no. <laughs> I, I, think yeah. I, I think you've learned enough through uh, trial and error that we've been able to hang on. Yeah. I'm going to predict, though, that around round 11, that's it. Yeah, round. I, I think night comes every five missions, so um, we're due for another one. Like, we got through that okay, and then I could see by the end of round 10, like, we have, like, 100 hit points left on our barracks when we win, and then round 11 is just <laughs> over. Yeah, that's true. Maybe I should heal up the barracks, huh? Before I do anything else. Okay. Um, we should definitely probably upgrade the barracks next 
video. Yeah, we probably were going to want a lot more hit points for that. Yeah. So, uh, you know, thank you, Anthony, for joining me on this Let's Play. Thank you, everybody that's watching. You know, people seem to really be enjoying these and, uh, you know, being entertained by them. And I'm certainly entertained making them. Yeah, so yeah. Just let us know if there's any other games you'd like us to do at some point. Yeah. That'd keep be cool to know, too. As long as you keep watching, um, we'll keep making them. And uh, stick around next time where we show some of the... Uh, the more advanced upgraded barracks weapons. Um, so for more on Block Fortress and all the hottest mobile games, make sure you're keeping it locked to IGN.